Hello guys again, this is Rudakira, and today I'm bringing you a special box opening for Core Set 2021. Now I'm really excited for this set because it has this new planeswalker named Basri Kent based off of the, oh, hold on, based off of the Ammon Kits uh, plane. And I'm really hoping to get them. Of course, uh, the other big big guys to get would be like Ugin, Teferi, Grim Tutor, any of those would be awesome. Let me put this to the side. Okay, let's get the Kraken. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Sanctum Calmwaters, Garuk's Uprising, Tide Scammer, and Feline Sovereign for a first rare. Oh, so that's a st Stitcher for a... She looks a little bit... I don't know if you can see in the camera, she looks a little bit faded. Sapling. Oh. Uh, why do I want to stack these? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Common Upsubstantiate, Fierce Empath, Kinetic Augur, and Brash Taunter for our rare. Oh, and the Showcase Island. Pretty cool. And of course, the, the main planeswalkers are also in this set Chandra, Nisa, not Nisa, uh, Garuk. The fairy instead of Jace, Chandra's Pyreling, Liliana's Devotee, Reign of Revelation, and Niambi, Esteemed Speaker for a rare. Jeez, here. Uh, Liliana, Ugin, and Basri Cat. That's what we got. Experimental Overload. Tormod's Crypt, Battle Rattle Shaman, and Necromentia. Necromentia. Wait, oh. Let's open to see what kind of, which mythics we're gonna get. Oh look, the new showcase type. Oh, and that's the, the other one. Skyway Sniper, Silvermount Ghoul, Riddle Form, and the Temple of Mystery for a rare. Now, the temples are a hit and miss, to me at least. You know, you, most people at this point already have them, because they've been released so many, so many times. But it's still good to, to have some sort of rare land cycle, I guess. Oh, Empathath Golem, Sanctum of Tranquil Light, Tide Skimmer, and Temple of Melody. With a prismite for our foil. Second foil. I'm spamming the card randomly, not really. Using rhyme or reason. Cultivate, Pestilent Haze, Soul Seer, and Elder Gargaroth for our first mythic. Pretty awesome and a showcase of showcase play. Now I think I'm gonna put them over here because I'm not good at organizing things. Oof. Oh. Got indulgent patrician, leafkin avenger, sanctum of fruitful harvest. And Vito Thorn of the Th Dusk Rose. I'm sorry. I like him. I think he, he's he's solid for vampires. And we might get more vampire support later down the line. At least in standard. For standard. Trying to keep these together. Oh, the showcase. Hellkite Punisher. Eliminate. 
Seed Striker, and Bane Slayer Angel for our second Mythic. Awesome. I really liked this card when I saw it, but I never, I never was able to get one. Of course, there's dogs in this set, which is awesome. Chandra Spiraling, Angelic Ascension, Dire Fleet Warmonger, and Ghostly Pilferer. Oh, look. The tokens, they're pretty dang good. Put your guy over here. And, of course, there's several versions of every card, which is... I mean, honestly, I think it's getting a little bit ridiculous, but just keeping track of all of them. Alpine Houndmaster, Malefic Sight, Teferi's Tutelage, and Scavenging Ooze. So I think Scavenging, Scavenging Ooze, Ooze, for example, has, I think, the, I mean, obviously a foil version, but there's the Showcase, and then there's the, I think the Garouk Showcase version, Extended Art. I don't know. Opt. Oh, look. Chatter's Magma. Tampered Veteran. Bad Deal. Wildwood Scourge. And Double Vision. For our rare. Oh, and the Goblin Wizards. They're pretty funny. Uh, Rewind, Havoc Jester, Leafkin Avenger, and Containment Priest. Oh, and a Foil Swamp. Pretty awesome. Put you right there, I guess. I think Containment Priest is pretty good for, for white. Now, will white ever be in the meadow? I don't know. I really hope it will. Down the line. Probably after rotation. Tormod Script, Furious Rise, Watcher of the Spheres, and Subira to Sidi Carav uh, whatever. Meteorite. Man, I cannot say that. Cara Caravanier. Caravanier. It's Caravanier. Shock. Palladium Mirror. Cultivate, Gourmand, and of Temple of Silence. With, oh, our first foil rare, Ghostly Pilfer. I mean, personally, I don't have any of the temples, so it's nice to have them, but obviously I know most people would prefer a different cycle of rare lands. Right there. Oh, I feel like he has, it looked like he had a scuff. Tavern Swindler, Trashing Brontodon, Angelic Ascension, and Sporeweb Weaver. Sporeweb Weaver. Okay. Which is Cauldron, Thrashing Brontodon, Angelic Ascension, and Spark Hunter Masticore. With a Sporewood Weaver for a second foil rare. I mean, it's could have been worse. I mean, two foil rares is, is good, clearly. I wish it was a different foil rare, but beggars can't be choosers. Oh, Wolfine, look at that guy. Is he chewing on people's feet? Jesus. Light of Promise, Paladin Mirror, Lore Scale Quattle, and another Veto. Veto Veto. Of 
We got Selfless Savior, Obsessive Stitcher, Face Fetters, and Pursued Will. Pursued Will. Demon. So far, two mythics. But we're about to hit halfway, so. Still plenty of chances to get more. Oh. First uncommon, and it's a showcase Garuk's Uprising, Conclave Mentor, Shipwreck Towser, and Teferi's Ageless Insight. It's a solid card, but it's kind of slow. Four mana to not do anything for a turn is kind of weird. Sanctum of Stone Fangs, Dire Fleet Warmonger, Brofist Oak, and our first planeswalker, Liliana, Waker of the Dead. Oh, and uh, I haven't even seen this thing. Onake Ogre. Put you right there. Liliana's pretty cool. I like I like the art on this one because she looks like I don't know. She looks like cautious. You know, it's a very different take of Liliana. Whoop. Invigorating Surge, Selfly Savior again, Kinetic Augur, and Sanctum of All. This is the uh, you win card if you have Sanctums, right? Or no, this is if you have Shrines, while you control six or more Shrines, that ability triggers an additional time. Oh, and Faith, Feathers, and Foil. Gotta fix this pile. Okay, let's sift it through these. Fungal Rebirth. Lower Skill Quatlo. Tolarian Kraken. And Glorious Anthem for our rare. Pretty cool enchantment. Oh, Warded Battlements. A white artifact creature. Meteorite. Griffin Airy, Volcanic Geyser, Hooded Black Fang for a rare, and Appear into the Abyss. Hey, a third foil rare. And this one's not bad. Nice. And like I said, uh, beggars can't be choosers. I I'm not, I'm, I'm quite happy with the foil rares. All in all. That is pretty nice. That's some sick art too. Unsubstantiate, Carrion Grub, Waker of Waves, and Animal Sanctuary. Pretty cool. It's one of my favorite lands. Oh, you can't quite see it, but it's got like a bunch of freaking animals on it. It's cute. Another Fungal Rebirth, Experimental Overload, Bossy Solidarity, and Peer into the Abyss. Holy sh shoot. Oh, that's crazy. I didn't know you could get that. Right after the rare, you can get a Mythic. Oh, Extended Art, Grim Tutor. The only way that could get any better if it is if it was foil. Jeez. Ugh. That is crazy. I was not expecting that after a rare. Of course, that's like one of the best cards to get. Jeez. Unleash Fury. Lorske Quatlo. Talarian Kraken. And Heroic Intervention. That's a good reprint. Hold on, let's wait out that train. Okay. Next pack. And I'm opening it wrong. Come on. Okay. We got Rin, Rin Wingmare. Another Rewind. Face Feathers. 
and Garuk's Harbringer with a Silvermount Ghoul for the foil. Eventually, I'm gonna get the hang of this. But for now, you guys have to deal with me awkwardly moving everything. Tavern Swindler, Unleash Fury, Silvermount Go Ghoul, and Transmogri Transmogrify. I said Transmogrify. Now we could probably get like up to two more mythics, really, if we're lucky. Oh, that's just, that's cool. Traitorous Greed. Sanctum of Calm Waters. Heartfire Emulator. And another Animal Sanctuary. Oh, with a Showcase Swamp. Don't mind if I do. Oh, turn to slag. I remember this card from, I think, the... Meriden set, Miscast, Season Hallow Blade, Warden of the Woods, and another Ghostly Pilferer. Ooh, in a, in a swamp, a foil showcase swamp. That is sweet. Sweet, sweet. Dang, we got like five packs left. Let's see what we get. Archfiend's Vessel, Canopy Stalker, Siege Striker, and another Scavenging Ooze. Oh, with a Cage Zombie as a foil. Oh, and a Forest. I may have missed some showcase lands, and if I did, I'm sorry. Kind of getting excited here. Uh, let's see, we got a Chrome Replicator, a Gormand, Enthralling Hold, and a Stormwing Entity. Oh, same thing with Shattered Heights. I think this is the first time I got this one. Twin Blade Assassins. Sanctum of Fruitful Harvest and a Primal Might. Ooh. Come on now. Okay, we got em Epitaph Golem. Sanctum of Tranquil Line. I think that's the second time I got in that one. Battle Rattle Shaman. And a pack leader. Pack leader. Okay, last pack. What are we gonna get? What do we end with? Shipway Sniper. Waker of the Waves. Born of the Woods. And a Radha Heart of Keld. Oh, with a Basri's Acolyte. Whoa. All in all, I'd say it was pretty nice. Nice haul with the Mythics right there. And a huge pile of comments. Anyway, everybody, thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.